Good morning, or should I say afternoon? It's been a long day. This is Good Money Stewart coming at you with a haul that I did a couple of days ago, but I just put it off, and so I thought I'd do it today. So let's get started here. This is Thursday, and it is a blustery day here in Omaha, Nebraska. Those winds have started back up, and I am so glad I was off. My off days are Tuesdays and Thursdays, and Boy, am I glad. Am I glad I didn't have to get out in that today. Jules is at home with me because yesterday during her basketball practice, she had a little accident uh, while practicing and kind of injured her ankle. So we were both at home with Sayla, our little Pomeranian dog, and we've just done nothing today. And I don't feel bad about it. So except for this haul. So let's get started. If you really like my videos, please give me a thumbs up. If you don't, thumbs down. But if you really truly like them, please push that subscription button below, either hitting the thumbs up or the thumbs down to let me know you like the video. Okay, we are going to get started. I have a haul from Walmart's, no, Michael's, and Dollar Tree today. So I'm going to get started with this. No certain order. Um, this was from Dollar Tree, and it is for my little Salem, my little Pomeranian. She's been eating her food, and for some reason, I've been giving her that Purina Complete, Adult Complete, or something like that. And um, I don't know if I don't know if it's making her sick or what, but I thought I'd kind of change up on her, so I got her this. And this is the first time I've seen this in the dry. Uh, form. So this is the Caesar dry food filet mignon flavor real beef and I kind of gave her a little taste of it last night and she was killing it. So I'm going to see um, how this goes with her but I'm going to let her finish up the other before I, if she hears me talking about this she <laughs> before I give her this. So hopefully she'll like that a lot better. And that was from the Dollar Tree only a dollar Okay, I'm going to start off with a lot of this Christmas stuff that I have. And these are mostly for, not going on the tree, but for some um, products I'm going to be doing. These were the 15 ornament decorations, and they have them in the white. Uh, and I guess you call it this silver. It's kind of a silverish looking, but then it looks like a cream. And there's 15 in there. And this is from Christmas House. And these were a dollar. And then I got them in the green and the red. And God, these look like pumpkins to me. I don't know why. And the gold down here. And again, it was 15 and it is Christmas House. So I'm going to use these for a craft that I'm going to be working on and then I got them in the smaller uh, box which is still 16 and this is the red ones and it's Christmas house again I mean their their Christmas items are really I mean you can go to the bigger stores if you want but if you can go here and get them at a better price why not you know why not and then I got them in Oops, my bag keeps wanting to fall. The silver. And all of these are 16 in the box. Which I thought was pretty great. I got stuff falling, guys. I hope I don't bend over and fall out the chair. Oh, the camera turned around. Who's <laughs> following me? Okay, now this is the first time I've seen these. These are by... It just says Mary up here, but they're ornaments. And it's the and they these have the little clips on the back of them. So that's kind of great. If you don't want to glue. So there's three to a pack. So I got that in the silver. Let's see me get my bag right here today. Got it in the red. And I got it in the gold. Now you tell me those are not cute. And then I saw then I'm I'm really not buying candles too much like this because you could do it yourself but when I saw that silver around that 
I thought, how beautiful is that? So, and this is by uh, Lumin... What is that? Luminescence. Luminescence is the maker of that. But I got two of those. And then I got me some more of this uh, painter's masking tape. But I don't use it for that. I use it for crafts. And it is in the blue. It looks like a royal blue. So that is what I got for that. You know, I, I'm not a fan of glitter at all. Because it just gets over everything. And I've got to remember, some of the ladies say you can take the uh, hairspray and apply that so that that glitter does not get everywhere. Because I do not like glitter. Not a glitter fan. Okay, this is still... Okay, this is still the Dollar Tree. Okay, I... This is a repurchase because I've shown these before. These are the Campbell Soup Bowl Cozies. And you can see how you can put that right in there. Yesterday when I was in the store and they were just putting this out, I saw a price on there and I asked the lady who was the stalker putting them up. I said, is this the price for these? She said, no, honey. She said, that's the price at Walmart. These were $4.98. So to get these for a dollar... Yes, I got me two more. And like I said, they are the Campbell Soup Bowl Cozies. You can put your bowl of soup in there. If you, you know, if it's hot, you just want to go sit and enjoy your bowl of soup. So I thought for five bucks down to a dollar for me, it's a it's a go. I saw Miss Black Gold haul these, this um, Suddenly Grain Salad, Southwest Grain. And I finally saw it because I had not seen this before in the store. So I'm going to give it a try. And like she said, you do not boil the, uh, that word right there. I can never say that little word right there. You do not boil that. And the instructions on the back tell you that. She said prior, you used to have to boil it. And now you do not. So I've gotten the pasta salads for these by this particular company, Betty Crocker. So, I like their products. Oh, I can't say enough about these, and I got to stay away from them. These are the Biscolatis. Biscot, Biscolatis, however you say that. I've seen multiple of people hauling these, and my favorite is the lemon. The chocolate, the dark chocolate is fine, but I'm not into that. So, I, I'll get them. Give them away as gifts, but I don't really like them too much. Juliana likes these post them, toast them, <laughs> post them, toast them. And this is in the uh, frosted cookies and cream. So I got her that. And I'm going to try to use this in a recipe, Jif Puffed by Crafts, and see how that turns out. So for a dollar, they did not have my Reynolds wrap, like I said the other day. If you don't get that right away, you will lose out. So I went ahead and got this brand. And this brand is by, who is this by? All it says is made in the USA. But it'll work for what I need. And with the holidays coming up, it's best you stock. Because if you don't stock, things will be flying off the shelf. And I noticed yesterday, they pretty much were putting out... All the aluminum um, pans for your baking and stuff like that. It was pretty well stocked. So I'm going to start getting my plates and things because it's a coming fast. It's a coming fast. And before you know it, Thanksgiving is going to be up on us. Okay. Okay, I'm going to stop with that one. And then I'm going to do Big Lot and Michael's. That's, I'm sorry, my camera is Acting a little off there. Um, that's the other store I did yesterday. Gotta get that glitter off of there. But uh, you know what? I'm grateful. Uh, I'm grateful. I'm grateful. You know how your mornings can kind of start off if you let them a little rocky. And, and I was looking at some things and I was saying, oh, I just want to be, you know, be there in that place. And, and all of a sudden I caught myself and I said, you know what? Don't start. Do not start back up and start all over again and I had to do just that I had to back up start all over again 
get my mindset totally off of what I was looking at and know where I am. And you know what? I am where I am. And I am going to be grateful, not saying that I don't want to move on, but you know what? It's almost like somebody gets blessed with something and you're envious of what they've been blessed with. Wrong spirit. Because you need to rejoice with them because they have been blessed. Because believe it or not, yours is going to come. But if you're going to be envious, not good. Not good. So I remember when a friend of mine got blessed with her home. It was as if that home was mine. I went in that house and I was just totally just overwhelmed by what God had blessed her with. And not too long after that, some doors were open for me for some things that I had been praying and believing God for. So you know what? Today I'm grateful. I'm just, I'm simply grateful for life. I'm simply grateful that... I am who I am. God created me and the word says that we are created in his image. So if I'm created in his image, I ain't a bunch of mess. I'm something special. And that's the way you need to look at it. You're something special. Regardless of what your life looks like now, you are something special. So be grateful for where you are right now because tomorrow changes. So with that, you be blessed and know that you are special. Till we see one another again, this is Good Money Stewart signing off.